What is going on guys, SVTV here on some transfer news which has been coming through, filtering in from last night. We are covering it today, this time through around 10 o'clock, 10, 11 o'clock last night. And we have been told that striker Lewis Graven has been linked to championship side Bristol City, the same side who wants Leeds Tomlin after his successful loan spell there. FC Bournemouth striker Lewis Graven is been being linked with a move to Bristol City as the Robins ramp up their recruitment drive ahead of next season. Now, if we're having a look at it, it's they're really they're really going for it and I, I can't blame them. They they're fighting relegation last season and they're gonna really pressure it. The former Norwich and Mill striking completed eight million move back to Dean Court in January and paid a three and three and a half year deal with the Premier League side making sixteen appearances. The Robins are looking to bolster their attack and ranks, and despite being linked with a move for a nut cherries player and former loanee Lee Tomlin, Lee Johnson is thought to be keen on bringing in another out and out forward to accompany the likes of Jonathan Codgia, Aaron Wil Wilbraham, and Kieran Agard. Former Cherry scout Des Taylor, who moved to Ashton Gate some months ago, has good knowledge of Graben, having seen him play over two spells for the side. If you want to read more about that story, Links down in the description. My source is of bristolpost.co.uk. Do you want to see Grab and Stale go at the cherries? Comment down below. Going on to the second and final um, small news report Bournemouth target is staying put. Bournemouth's hopes of signing experienced striker Jermaine Defoe are now over after he extended the deal at Sunderland. Bournemouth was said to be in the running to sign the veteran last summer. And again in January, but their hopes have be, have been finally extinguished after his, his extended deal in the North East. The Black Cats confirmed on Thursday, the 33-year-old had signed a one-year contract extension. His reward for a remarkable return of 18 goals in all competition in a side in which struggled for much of the campaign. That source is back down in the description as my source is of clubcool.com. Do you want to see us bring in any more strikers? Put down in the description. Who do you want to see Bournemouth bring in? There is more all the transfer news for today. If you want to watch more Bournemouth, subscribe down to the channel. I've been Matt from ASB TV, and I'm out.